All right, let's finish this trifecta. Operating out of Maine, Vimpop Incorporated was a popular yet local soft drink manufacturer. Founded in 1931 by Herbert Reed, Vim was originally sold as a health tonic. While never reaching the status of Nuka Cola or even Sunset Sarsaparilla, Vim was reaching cult status in Maine and was up for consideration as the state's official drink. Even so, the company was in the red, with most of their expenditures coming from repairs. The losses would pile on as Vim lost a trademark battle with Nuka Cola over the court's name. Investors were losing faith, threatening to sell their shares to the Cola Corp. But CEO Doyle Reed had one last idea. The Vim Ambassador campaign was launched. The idea was to have powered armored spokespeople travel to communities and hand out free pop. The campaign was met with a ruthless counterattack. Nuka Cola hired mercenaries to try and shut it down, destroying trucks, sabotaging the factory, and even had a mole in the company to sow seeds of doubt in the investors. A second ad campaign featuring the slogan, Escape into Adventure, was a hit. That, and with their new flavor, Captain's Brew, Vim Pop Incorporated wasn't looking so bad after all. Well, that is until the bombs dropped.